Hi everyone and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. My name's Ellie and today I'm going to be doing another wig review. Woohoo! So this one was really nicely sent to me by, I'm not sure how to say it, I'm not sure if it's Atos or Atos wig. Um, it's like this, A-T-O-Z wig. Um, they sell their wigs on Amazon and they've also got an Instagram page, I believe they've got a Facebook page as well. I have opened it kind of tried it on um but i haven't properly tried it on if that makes sense i've taken it out of the bag and um, it comes in like a little black bag like this and it comes in a in a plastic bag inside so loads of protection and it also comes with a netting on as well so this one is a gorgeous platinum wig i'm really really excited about because i don't have a wig of this blonde it is a lace front wig, it's lace front, it's synthetic, and it is so soft. Like, I already know that this is so soft because I've already gone out of the bag because I got too excited, so sorry about that. Um, but yeah, look how stunning it is. It's really, really nice. I love these waves in the hair, really nice natural waves. It's not too, like, um, you know, like, some wigs come in, they're, like, they look too, like, styled, if that makes sense. Um, but this one's really, really nice. It's a little bob, and it is, um, all one length, I believe, which is really nice, because my other two bob wigs are, um, asymmetrical, which I do love them as well. The parting looks really nice from what I can see, and from what I briefly tried on, it does look really nice and natural. It doesn't have that horrible, like, plastic bit that you sometimes get underneath. Um, the parting doesn't come back very far, it only comes back a little bit and then it sort of like goes into the, like the tracks, but um, I'll see what it looks like when it's on, I'm really excited. I only really put it over my head like this, like really briefly, um, when I got it yesterday, I just couldn't, I was too excited. I was way too excited, so I'm just going to put on a wig cap. You do get sent a wig cap, you get given um, one of these, which is like the little na um I was going to say nace, which is like netting and lace. You get um, a wig cap, which is like a netted lace one, um, which is really nice, but um, I do personally prefer the nude ones that sort of like, I like this. So I'm just going to pop this on my head. It has got three clips here, which I'm still not even sure what they're for. I need to know. Um, because I don't understand, if they're supposed to clip under your hair, how are they supposed to do that when you've got a wig cap on? Oh, but if it's netted, it could go through the net. And they've also got, um, the adjustable straps at the bottom. Here. So I just like to tie them to the middle, sort of. Show you in a sec, just do that. So I just like to put mine sort of to about there, in the middle. That's normally, for most wigs, like sort of like the size of my head. Um, I'm just gonna put this on, it is very blonde and I do have, not really dark eyebrows, but they're quite dark, um, obviously for blonde, but I'm gonna put it on, I'm gonna put it on. I look like a Barbie. The parting is amazing. Like, look at that. It looks like it's coming up my head. Apart from my actual hair showing, I need to pull that wig cap down. Oh my god. <laughs> so impressions so far. The colour is amazing. Like, it's a very, very um, blonde wig. Um, if you want in this blonde, obviously it's not a natural colour at all, so um, it is really nice. I'm actually fancy dress going as um, Barbie on Saturday, so this is like perfect. I'm 100% going to use it. The um, parting looks really, really nice and natural from what I can see. Um, it does seem to come a little bit more down this side than this side, but I don't know if that's the way I've got it on my head. Um, I'll have to cut the lace and see, but it looks really nice. It's coming down nice and far on that side, but not so far on this side. Maybe it's a, oh, I think it might be a side part in. Bear with me, being stupid. Oh yeah, that's better. <laughs> I really like it, it's so soft. I'm just gonna give it a brush. I wish I had this hair. 
sweets. Do you know what I really like about this wig? Is there's not too much hair. Like sometimes there's bloody way too much hair and it's just like, all right, I know I'm wearing a wig. Okay, it looks nice. I'm tying it up. I need to cut this lace because I need to see. So I'm gonna go and cut the lace off the front and then I'll be back. So I've just cut all the lace off and I think I've done it okay. The straps have come and done, so I'm just gonna put them back on. Right, so it's a side part nearly. I should have known that from the bloody picture. Oh my god, that looks so much better already. So look at this part in, it looks so natural. Look at that! I love it. Okay, so the tracks do are here and they do stop there. And they kind of do, this kind of lifts up a little bit. But I think that's where it's been in the bag. Um, I reckon you could probably like pin that down or straighten it down a little bit. I'm not actually sure if you can. See, that's that already. Um, I'm not sure if you can put heat on them. You'll have to double check on the website um, on Amazon. But you might be able to put a little bit of heat on them. Some, some synthetic wigs you can. Um... As most wigs, obviously, if you lift that up, it's going to be there. But I could probably tuck my hair in a lot more. And I normally, I normally pull like this front section down and put a bobby pin in. Sort of like slide it in there just to sort of like hide away my real hair. Just because I don't really stick my wigs down. A, because I'm lazy. Um, and two... A and two, great. Um, because I don't really want to get all glue in my hair and, or in my wig and then have to wash it, um, which also comes back to being lazy. So I normally just pin mine down with bobby pins and I'm absolutely fine. But the more I'm wearing this, the more I actually love it. And I think you could get away with tying it up. I feel like Daenerys. So you can tie them in little bunches, you can be Emma Bunton, put little buns. I did that the other day, my grey wig looked really cute. So it's coming up on there as $26.99 plus free delivery. So I do have Amazon Prime, so I don't know if it's coming up free delivery because um, I've got Amazon Prime or not, but I'm pretty sure... I don't think it is because it doesn't it doesn't have the prime button. So it's coming up on here. Don't know if you can see that. It's $26.99. On the bag it is ATOZ wig. And on their Instagram is ATOZ wig. But on here it's ATZ. So um just to remind you, but I will um put a link of it down below because for $26.99 I think this is a really gorgeous wig and I think you could use it for fancy dress you could use it for um day to day which is what I normally use my wigs for because um I do have really short hair I love to change my hair up and also um as I've said in like nearly every video I am going to be shaving off my hair in literally it's a week tomorrow um for when I'm filming this so this is a Wednesday um and oh my god I am literally in love I'm so excited to wear this on Saturday. But thank you again so much for sending me this wig. Um, I don't know what else to say for $26.99. It's really, really nice. The only thing I would say is um, these track things here. But, um, you know, you can cover it with your hair. And it's already dropped quite a lot since. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, this is my problem. When I get a new wig, I'm like... Who am I? Who is she? Okay, thank you very much for watching. That is the end of today's video. If you did enjoy it, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. But yeah, thank you so much for um, subscribing, for watching, for everything. Um, yeah, and stay tuned for more. Please comment if there's anything you'd like me to, um, you'd like me to do, because I'll do it. And like, obviously within reason. But anyway, thanks for watching. Bye!